I'm in the Mobile World Live studio with Chad Dudevant, who is the Chief Product and Strategy Officer at CSG Systems. Hi, Chad. Hi, Kevin. Good to be here. It's great to have you. So first question, last year was eventful for CSG. Can you briefly bring us up to speed on the company's growth trajectory and your role in this momentum? Sure, yeah. I mean, the last couple of years, CSG has been hyper-focused on really what we call um, a purpose-driven um, SaaS platform business. And really what that means for us is de developing software applications for the CSP community that are repeatable, uh, that are configurable, that are scalable, and that are always, always uh, reliable. And I think that's really a differentiator in the IT landscape for a lot of software vendors um, like ourselves. And, and really what we're focused on then is how do we build those applications um, to give the operators the flexibility they need to support the use cases they may not, may not even know about. Um, my role as a product strategy officer, I help set those guidelines uh, for the company. I help set the standards for which uh, we want to produce software applications. Uh, but more importantly, I also focus on the M&A side, so the inor inorganic side of our growth. And we've been really active over the last two years of, of really rounding out our portfolio so that when we go to an operator to help them solve their most critical business needs, we're bringing together the solutions, the products, and the services um, that are really pre-integrated and available kind of off the shelf. And in the year since you launched CSG and Compass, um, what impact has your solution had in helping CSPs address the B2B 2X market challenge? Yeah, we see a big opportunity um, in the enterprise space on the back of the 5G rollouts. And what we've noticed in the industry is a lot of the enterprise platforms that have been built over the last two decades plus really aren't equipped to support um, the digital nature of uh, the enterprise needs. Um, so with Encompass, we're focused on how do we support the operator's uh, transition in their enterprise business uh, to support some of these new digital needs. For example, we've rolled out what we call CSG Encompass CPQ. Uh, this is a purpose-built uh, configure price quote uh, platform that helps the CSP quickly introduce new products and services to the market. It's a different kind of value proposition than you have in the consumer space. I'm not selling a handset. I'm not selling a package. I'm not selling a prepaid SIM card. I'm selling a, a big set of network services that have a lot of complexity and they differ across each enterprise customer that they have. So that the platforms that have to exist for those type of, of use cases are very different. And I think something that is uh, differentiated from our purpose-built telco, telco CPQ. And what do CSPs need to consider when looking at their digital delivery and digital experience strategies so they can inspire customer loyalty and drive better business outcomes? You know, the, the enterprise is an extension of the CSP now, right? So when I'm a consumer and I in, engage with um, my enterprise for services, whether it's my doctor's office or my dentist's office or um, my, local, uh, my local grocer, the backbone that those services are riding on are from the, the CSP. And so the CSP has to think about all the additional value-added services that they can provide to the enterprise that eventually touch the customer. Um, there's a lot of value in what we call first-party data, the data that sits in the systems um, that are owned and operated by the CSP. And really what CSG is focused on in our customer experience platforms is how we unlock that data and make it very usable for um, the CSPs and eventually their, their consumers, whether it's the enterprise or the, the end business. Um, and in doing so, we can start to build journeys, um, customer engagement strategies um, that, that um, engage with, with each consumer really on their um, their preferences and, and their demands. As CSPs modernize their infrastructure and technology stack with solutions like Encompass, how will their efforts translate into custom experience? Where does CX for telco operators need to go next? Yeah, I, I think I, we talked a little bit about this, this notion of first party data. It's, you know, it's, it's easy to fall back a lot of times onto third party data, the data you get from mining you know, internet traffic and web searches. It's a lot harder to mine that first party data. So we're, we're really helping the, um, the operators leverage the platforms that they have today, but start to leverage the data that they have within their, their tools and their platforms to expose then the, the customer engagement strategies that are most, most relevant. Chad, that was great. Thanks for your time. Yeah, thank you.